So do you guys want an amazing method in earning an absolute ton of gold? Well, today I have you covered. So earning gold in this game is super important if you want to buy those beautiful products from all the vendors and NPCs in this game. Well guys, today I bring you an incredible method. I'm not going to say it's the best method in the game. For me right now though, it definitely is. But it is an incredible method in earning an absolute ton of gold. Now you will need a few things. You will need to have played the game quite a while and you will need to have completed a quest called the Elf, the Nabsack and the Loom. Now this is probably about 25 to 30 of the main quests into the game of course when i completed i'll show you um i did it not long after these ain't in order by the way i did it not long after the beast uh, class which i think like paves the way for this it's this one right here now once you actually complete this guys you are given that nab sack the nab sack is used to collect those beasts beasts that go into your beast tab right here now, what we're going to do is, guys, there's actually a great little spot to actually go out and get these beasts. You can collect 20 of them at a time and sell them for like 120 each. And that's where this vendor in Hogsmeade comes in handy. She will also be unlocked for you along the way. So she's right here, as you can see, in Hogsmeade. So the beasts we're going to collect, which we can get probably 20 in a few minutes, can bring you here and sell them for 120 each. It is that crazy. Now, while I have your attention, guys, if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like really helps me out. And if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe and turn those notifications on. So you'll make sure, guys, that Nabsack is applied to your spell diamond because this is important. And then, well, we want to travel to this great little spot. So bring up your map. And we want to go to, it's actually just above Hogsmeade. Uh, it's just, actually, we're going to have to go to the world map, to be honest. Let's go here. We need to go to... Where am I? It's right there. See that little dot there? That is where we need to go to. So any fast travel point, any uh, flu flame, perfect. Just fly here. Simple. Simple people. Now when you land, jump on your boom and just fly across. And look, there's loads of these dudes here, guys. There's absolute loads of these dudes here. So yeah. Let's just go. Let's just fly across. See, it's right next to this flu flame as well. If you've got your broom, you can get here in literally five to ten seconds. This place has seen better days. And as you can see, just jump, simply jump off right about here. And you'll see a ton of them there. They're in the trees. They're absolutely everywhere. Now, once you've collected them, uh, which is quite easy, I'll show you that in a quick second. You can, if there's not enough for your bag, you can simply go back to the traf uh, fast travel point and come back here. They do respawn after a certain while, but it's much quicker if you go to the fast travel point. Let's quickly zoom back here. Now, there's a, way, a few methods you can use to collect these things. It doesn't really matter. You, know, you just need to focus on one, point your bag at it, and select it. Simple as that. And there you go. There's one. You also earn XP for this as well, so keep that in mind. So, yeah, it's, it's, it's much easier in the daylight. I don't know why I'm doing this in the night time, but hey. Simple, simple, simple. And while well, I just collect these little beasts, you'll see they will run around in the area. But they always do make their way back to you, which is just great because it just makes things easy for you. And like I said, they're way, way easier than any other beasts I've come across so far. Boom. And then just simply do this, guys, and quickly just, well, once your bag is full. Again, like I said, you have 20 spots to fill inside your inventory. So you can do this rinse and repeat until this is full. Simply then go back to uh, Hogsmeade and sell them as you see me do on screen now. And you'll earn, what, there's 20 here, 20 times uh, 120 is a lot of dash for a short amount of time. And you'll not realise this with how hard cash is uh, to get in this game. So yes guys, I hope this helps you out and take advantage of it while you can. Now if there's any other beast in the game you know of that's easy to catch and you can sell for more money. I'm not sure there's any you can sell for more money. Please do let me know. But yes, guys, I hope this video helps you out. And hopefully my beautiful people, I will see you on that next one.